Eurasian food and Pranakan food takes a lot of effort in preparing. As a Pranakan, if you are able to continue this cuisine, you still keep the Pranakan tradition. For the Eurasian food, there are not many people in Singapore that actually have a place that serves Eurasian food, and uh, that is also dying off. It's very sad because in 20 years time, people will not know what is wokloa. They will not know what's a chicken devil's curry. It will be all about fast food, pre-packed food, food from the frozen bin, and things like that. So it's very very sad. I grew up being very privileged to have a Pranakan grandmother and a Eurasian mother and we grew up eating both cuisines. So I thought over the years I've learned uh, from my mom and my grandmother and I would like to bring it up to the public to share with the public what we grew up eating when we were young because the current youngsters would not be able to try it. It's a very tedious uh, occupation to begin with. Many hours is spent in the kitchen and uh, you're on your feet for hours. Young people nowadays prefer to work in the office in the comfort of the aircon rather than to go out and sweat it out in behind the kitchen. That's why we see that we are losing out on the younger generation in the hawker culture. In 2014 when I came up, because my kids are grown up and I thought that uh, with the encouragement of my children, I should do something which I grew up with. But as years goes by, it's becoming discouraging at the moment because of COVID-19, the takings have dropped drugs and it's really, really a struggle now. It's very difficult nowadays to get a salary. Uh, should I carry on or should I just call it a day? There are many people like us who won't be around, let's say, in 10 years' time. And I think it will be, you will lose it completely. I hope Popo and Nana's the like, the name will stay, but I don't see it happening. I really cannot say what is going to happen in the next five years. I'll try to keep the name and continue the tradition of this food. If otherwise, then I think um, I will have to retire. And I hope that does not happen so soon.